Which of the following best represents the dissolution of gaseous ammonia, NH3, in water? Ammonia is a molecular molecule. Molecular compounds that are either unionized or only partially ionized in aqueous solution are best represented by putting a parentheses AQ label next to the formula of the compound. Ammonia is only partially ionized. Therefore, choice A is the correct answer. It starts with gaseous ammonia and ends up with aqueous ammonia. When gaseous ammonia is dissolved in water, most of the NH3 molecules are individually hydrated. By hydrated, we mean that the molecule is surrounded by water molecules. We symbolize this idea by simply putting an AQ label next to the formula for ammonia. D shows what happens to a very small fraction of NH3 molecules in water. This would be the chemical equation that we would write to account for the fact that a solution of ammonia in water is basic. We say that ammonia is a base because putting it in water leads to the production of hydroxide ions. An ammonia molecule can take a hydrogen away from a water molecule to form an ammonium ion. The water molecule ends up being a hydroxide ion. Because only a small fraction of ammonia molecules end up doing this, we say that ammonia is a weak base. Choice C is also wrong. There is no such thing as ammonium hydroxide molecules. However, you should be aware that commercially available aqueous solutions of ammonia are called ammonium hydroxide.